Okay, sixth grade, lesson 114. This one is on unit multipliers. Now, a unit multiplier is something like this. Uh, one foot equals 12 inches, right? Or we could say 12 inches equals one foot, okay? And the way you write that when you're making it, making it a unit multiplier, <laughs> you take one foot equals one, um, one foot equals 12 inches and you put one foot over 12 inches. And that just kind of shows you that the one foot is 12 inches, or I could have written it, 12 inches is the same thing as one foot, okay? You see how these both mean the same thing, but they're just different on the top or bottom? Okay, <laughs> now that's important because I'm gonna take off this information and I'm gonna, I want you to listen to what I say. We're gonna use a unit multiplier to convert one unit of measure to another. For example, let's convert, um, convert 60, 60 inches to feet. Now, <laughs> if I wanna convert 60 inches to feet, what I'm gonna do is go 60 inch, inches times either this or this, okay? Now, what I want you to see is what am I trying to convert it to? Two feet, 60 inches to feet. What am I converting it to feet? To feet, okay. So, I want you to remember this. Whatever you're converting to, <coughs> you're gonna use the one that's on the top. We're converting it to feet. So I want feet on top. So watch what I do. I'm going to use this one. I'm not going to use that one. I'm going to use this one and go one foot is the same thing as 12 inches. Right? Now watch what happens. If, I, if this is a fraction and I make that a fraction, watch what happens. 60 times 1 is 60. 1 times 12 is 12. But stay with me. Look what happens here. Inches, inches cross out. Do you remember how? Oh, I could actually, let's do that right now. <laughs> I can actually reduce this right now. What goes into both 12 and 60? Six. Six would, um, but you can actually do, let's go on and do six. You can actually do one more, uh, a little bit higher, but let's go on and do six and you'll, it'll just take two 12. steps. 12, good job. 12 will go into 12, how many one times? Time. One time, okay? We're going to 65 five times, five. right? <laughs> 12 times five is 60, yes. So, okay, sorry about that. Okay, so we were talking about 12 goes into 12 one time and 12 goes into 60 five times. Now, let's multiply five times one is five, five and one times one is four. one. Now, Let's look at, since we crossed out our numbers, guess what? We can also cross out our inches because okay. inches over inches knocks them out. Yep. Okay? So now what do I have left? Feet. Feet. Because it didn't cross out. So, so five one. over one is the same thing as five. five. So the answer is five feet. So basically you take whatever you're wanting to convert and put it over one. Then you, <coughs> then you multiply it by one of these unit multipliers, either this one or this one. And how do I know which one I'm supposed to use? If I'm converting it to feet, you put the feet on top, right? Very good, excellent job. Okay, let's try a few more, okay? Okay, this time, um, <clears throat> first of all, they want me to write a unit multiplier for this. Three feet equals, do you know how many yards? Um, one yard. You may not have known that. I don't know. Okay. Three feet see. equals one yard. So, how would I write this as a unit multiplier? Um, you would do three feet over one. Over one yard. Times. No, 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 no. We're just writing the unit multipliers right now. Twelve okay. inches over one foot. One foot over twelve inches. Okay. So, so three foot like over one yard. One yard over. Feet. One yard over three feet. That's the important part. Now, once you've gotten those, <clears throat> now let's take the problem. Listen to the problem. <clears throat> they want us to convert 
30 yards to feet. Okay? So if I'm wanting to convert it to feet, which one of these am I going to use? Uh, three feet. Which one's on top? Uh, this one? feet. Very yeah. good. So this is the one I'm going to use, right? Mm -hmm. Okay, so I can erase this one. That was just helped me to develop it. Okay, so now I'm going to take 30 yards and I'm going to convert it to feet. So, let me write this over here. Three feet equals one yard. I'm going to erase this <laughs> because I want to write 30 yards <clears throat> over uh, three feet. No, this Wait, is three feet over oh, a yard. Oh, so 30 yards over one. Over one. Remember, oh, really? you're just trying to make it into a fraction. Okay. Times, remember this? Mm -hmm. So you do cross multiply, right? Right. <laughs> okay. So is there anything I can cross out by numbers? You can cross out... Nothing by numbers. Because it has to be, one has to be on the numerator, one has to be on the denominator. And here I have the numerator and numerator could be reduced, but you can't reduce numerator and numerator. It has to be crossed. Okay. <laughs> or at least numerator or denominator. Okay, 30 times 3 is... Okay, so wait a minute. What, what can we cross out, though? A uh, yard. Yards. Yards and yards. Very good. So then that answers, that gives us the answer in feet, which is what we're wanting to convert it to. Mm -hmm. Okay, okay. So 30 times 3 is 90. 90 feet. Feet. Very good. So 30 yards is 90 feet. Yep. Okay? You feel like you understand it? Yeah. All right. Now let's try something else. Using those same unit multipliers, <coughs> three feet is one yard, and one yard is three feet. Let's use that same, those two unit multipliers and answer this. They want me to convert, convert 30 feet to yards. Which one am I going to use? Um, you would use <laughs> feet, right? Well, I'm converting 30 feet to yards. Oh, I got you. Okay, so you used three feet over one yard, right? I want the one I'm converting to to be on top. Oh, okay. So the second one. I'm going to use this one. So this one is just, was just there to help me because I had to do both of them. Okay, so I'm converting 30 feet to yards. So I take 30 feet times... This, one yard over three feet, and then I go in and put this over one, right? Is there anything I can cross out numbers? <laughs> uh, numbers, no, yeah. Yes. One, right? Three, well, three will go into both of them. What do you mean? Three, uh, three yeah. Is three. there any bigger no? no. No, that's okay. it. Three will go into three. One time. One time. Three, three will go into 30. 30. Ten, ten times. times. Three times ten is thirty. Okay, and now feet and feet yeah. cross out, and that leaves us yards, which is good because that's what we're wanting to convert it to. Ten so now yards. 10 times 1 is 10, ten. Yep. 1 times 1 is 1, and then 10 yards. yards and then over what is so 30 feet equals 10 yards. 10 yards. Very good. Feel like you understand it? Yeah. <clears throat> Pretty good? That's lesson.